Good evening, Saints. Minister Paul, Northern California. It's still 125, 2013. Uh, it's 1105, which is actually a 7567 um, p.m. <clears throat> Last night, uh, I was talking to Tom on the UK on one of the videos. I was told him that we needed to watch that the Holy Spirit had told me that the West Coast was in trouble and since he's in the UK he's eight hours ahead I went to bed and he said he would stay up and pray and we prayed for the West Coast in Mexico um, I put this in the feed instead of you know doing what God had told me to do make a video which I did actually um, but I didn't upload it and then today I made two more. This one was a half hour long. I figured nobody would watch that. That map right there is an earthquake of Fairfield. Um, I put this in the feed at 12.37 a.m. Which is a 3.37. Three, seven, or 7 sets of 3. 21 hours ago, which is 7 times 3. I said bloodshed which I haven't read about yet, but I know I will sometime soon, soon, fire, explosion, an earthquake, I just posted this in the feed, this was the lazy way to do it, kind of say, hey God, look, I did my watcher on the wall, God. and I want to talk to the true watchers on the wall, there's a lot of people saying they're watchers, but they're not, nothing they're saying is happening, I'm going to talk to the true watchers that are hearing from God. Um, and, and only God knows who they are. How long, Lord, will thou be angry forever? Shall thy jealousy burn like fire? Pour out thy wrath upon the heathen, or the sinners, that have not known thee. And upon, this is important, kingdoms that have not called upon thy name. Entire kingdoms will, are going to come under this. Not just one little city like where I grew up. Entire kingdoms are going to come under all of this. Biblical reference, Matthew 24, Luke 21. Um, well, if you go to the earthquake map, there was two earthquakes. In that uh, This one made the news. It's on the news right now. 2.9 doesn't sound much. And then a 2.9 north of me. But you know what's interesting about it is that's this is 1111. Just like my address and the same uh, month and day 1111 that I officially went into the ministry of prophetic. Here's the earthquake. Look, it's also a, an 11 and 11. And then see that 12, that's a 3 and a 7. But notice it was 38 miles of Sacramento that I've been talking about, uh, which is an 11. And here's the fire. So I showed you the earthquake here, right? Notice it's getting closer to Sacramento and closer to the Bay Area. Here's the fire still burning right now as we speak. At 11.09, uh, it's still burning. This movie theater you're going to see is where I got in the two fights and got arrested and put in juvenile hall uh, in the vi video I just did on humility. The movie theater is gone. But I grew up with it. It's been there since the 60s. It's gone. It's a five alarm blaze. <laughs> That's the movie theater right there. That's where I grew up. First grade, second grade, third grade, fourth grade, all the way to 11th grade and joined the Navy. This is the heart of downtown. This whole street shut down right now as I make this video. So what happened? And look at when they say the fire started. Seven. So... You ask yourself, well, why didn't he make these videos? 
Well, for one, here they are. I did make them. I just didn't upload them because I listened to people and not God. I got a private email uh, saying one of my videos was not of God and I needed to really pray about it. And I was thinking, well, wouldn't God tell me that if that was the case? And I did pray and he didn't tell me to remove it, so it's still up. And then another person um, uh, sent me a PM saying that I wasn't a prophet, you know, that that uh, that I was an administrator. So they just decided out of the blue, look, it's 11-11, to tell me what my calling was. Listen, if, if you've been called to do something from God, you better listen to me because I feel a heaviness on my heart and I need to spend time on my knees repenting. Not because I didn't tell you to, because I disobeyed God when I was shown something. I mean an earthquake and a fire because this was a test and I failed. And um, I asked God for forgiveness publicly in front of the whole world to forgive me. This will not happen again. I don't care what anybody tells me because the issue is not whether I uploaded this to YouTube or not. Nobody was injured, praise God, because we were praying. The issue is that this is going to increase. Surely it will happen. No one will convince me it won't on a larger scale. And if the Lord reveals to me any information on it, I'm not going to listen to man or woman on whether what my calling is or whether it's from God or not. I'm going to obey God. Tonight I was in disobedience and did it the lazy way by posting it in the feed. When these were supposed to go up, whether you watched them or not, was not my problem. So I repent. Not going to happen again. You can send me all the messages. I'm honestly, if you're a watcher on the wall, please listen, because I know you go through the same thing. You can send me all the messages you want. Tell me what my calling is. You know, tell me I'm a false prophet. Make videos about me. It's irrelevant. Because I'm the one that has to stand before Christ and, and, and be held accountable for what I did in my calling. Not you. You won't be there. It'll just be me and Christ. And uh, I'll be forgiven for this. But the main thing is, it's not going to happen again. You don't want to watch the video because you think they're too long. Go watch them. That's not, that, my job isn't to make you watch them. My job is to sound me alive. Thank you.